Hi, my name is Saira Vega with Cisco Tech. I want to show you how to properly configure inbound management access on UCS Manager. With inbound management, the traffic traverses the fabric interconnect via the uplink ports. So let's step through the process. Launch UCS Manager or log in with your username and password. First, go to the LAN tab and navigate to IP pools. Right click IP pools and select create IP pool. Enter a name, click next to continue. We will use IPv4 addresses in this example. Click add. In the create a block of IP addresses dialog box, complete the fields. Click OK and then Next. Click Finish. The next step is creating the inbound management VLAN. In the LAN tab, right click on VLANs under LAN Cloud and select Create VLANs. Enter a name for the VLAN and the VLAN ID. Optionally, you can click on Check Overlap to verify whether the VLAN ID overlaps with any other IDs on the system. Click OK to finish. Next, we will need to define a VLAN group. In the same tab, right click on VLAN groups and select Create VLAN group. Provide a name to the VLAN group. In the list of VLANs, Select the newly created inbound management VLAN. We don't need to select an uplink port, a port channel, or organization permissions. Click Finish. Now that we have the IP pool, the inbound management VLAN, and the VLAN group, we will configure the inbound profile. In the LAN tab, click on LAN Cloud. Then click on Global Policies. Under Inbound Profile, use the drop down options to set the inbound VLAN group as the previously created group, set the network to the previously created VLAN, and set the IP pool name to the previously created IPv4 address pool. Click Save Changes. Finally, we will assign the inbound management IP to our server. If we want to assign it to the service profile, navigate to the Service tab and select the desired service profile. In the General tab, under Actions, scroll down and select Change Management IP Address. Click the Inbound tab. In the Inbound IPv4 tab, select from the drop-down the Management IP Address pool that we previously created, if not already selected. Click OK to finish. If we want to assign the inbound IP to the server CIMC, go to the Equipment tab and navigate to the server you wish to configure. Click Inventory and then click CIMC. Under Action, select Change Inbound Management IP. On the network, select the inbound management VLAN if not already selected, and select from the drop down menu the management IP address pool. The inbound management configuration is now complete. To test the inbound management connectivity, we will open the KVM console for this server. In the Server General tab under Actions, Click on the Greater Than Greater button next to KBM Console. This will show the available management IP addresses for this server. Click OK to open the KBM Console. The KBM Console will launch using the inbound IP address. For further configuration steps on this topic, please refer to the Cisco UCS Manager Administration Management Guide. Thank you for watching.